Teaching is my passion. I love kids. I love what I do. I'm excited to come to work on most days and I just love it. I love to teach math. I love to see kids when they have a breakthrough. I just love it. I love watching them learn. I love watching them get excited about learning and finding out new things. So that's what brings me to work every day. I received an excellent education as a child and I wanted to pass that on to other children. Since I was, I would say, seven, eight years old, um, when it was the time to play with my siblings, I always pick be the teacher and they have to be my student. Being an educator is what I do. I love teaching. I've been doing this for 12 years. I've always wanted to be a teacher. I feel like as I watch my students grow, that I feel like I'm making an impact and that they're doing great things. So I like to see them years later when they come back and they tell me all the good things that they're doing. Being an educator is having an impact on my students' lives. Beyond what we learn in the classroom, beyond what they're going to be tested on, but having that positive impact, being able to push them a little bit, um, maybe being that one person who kind of pushes them to really kind of stretch themselves, get out of their comfort zone, and do their best. I want to be an example of um, not only a, a woman who is doing this, but an African American who is doing this to, to show them that it is possible. It's not an impossible dream that you could do it too. I'm a living example that you could be good at math to try to take some of the phobia out of it. As an educator, is to teach my students how to think and how to rationalize. That's why I like math, because it's logical. You can always figure it out and try to relate the algebra to real life, which is hard to do sometimes. But if they know why they got to learn it, it's a little easier to convince them to learn it. Besides, because you got to pass the test. I raise myself to every day be better than the day before. And I think that this is what the profession is about. And also, I believe that this is a profession that we never finish to learn. I learn every day from my students. They journal for me every day. We talk a lot, so I know what they want, I know what their goals are, I remember things. So when you make that personal connection with them, it's a little bit easier to figure out, okay, this is what makes this kid tick. We invest quite a bit of time on building community, about building relationships with each other. Getting children ready for their future because it's unbelievable what's out there for them these days, and I would love to know that they went forward into the world and I had a part in making it a better place for them. I started here in 1987, did my student teaching here in 1986. And I've always loved East Tech, that's why I never left here. These kids are the most gracious kids I think around. All my students are a special needs, which I love them. We work here in this classroom using both languages, English or Spanish, whatever he feels comfortable. I don't want any little kiddos of my classroom leave my classroom sad. I try to make them feel comfy here in this classroom, but also at the same time that uh, teach them that learning is part of our daily basic day. Every day, every single person learns something new. This is my philosophy. I really just love my job. I really just like being a teacher and it's not always the easiest job. We all know that the teachers in Cleveland are the best teachers. These are the most professional, inspiring people that I've ever been around in my life. So, you know, I'm very proud to be around them and I understand that, you know, we just got to keep doing what we're doing. If you get one kid that comes back and say, hey, what you did meant so much to me, then it's, it's worth it in the end to just have one. And most of us will have certainly more than one.